Hey everybody, welcome back to The Surge. We're a little bit uh, behind where we stopped because I think we auto-saved there. Yeah, okay. So we opened up this door, which showed us that we can get back into the main assembly area. We're in the train station. Uh, there's also the rocket yard assembly halls power plant, all of which areas we've been to, I think. So I gotta say, like one of the cool things about this is the level design. There's a lot of shortcuts that we found. Um, I do believe, though, that we said we wanted to head deeper down here and see what else was happening underneath the power plant. Now, if we had some chest gear, some body gear, um, we could have some additional lighting, which would be really beneficial. Which might be a good idea to head back to our med bay at some point. What do we got going on here? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. This... This is not good. This is not good. Okay, fantastic. So maybe we have to go back to the med bay at this point. It's kind of creepy, actually. Where's this taking us? Have we been through this section? We're not gonna pass here, right? It's, it's security personnel? Required. Right. So it's looking like it's scanning us, and we've ran into that previously where I thought maybe we need to use some of the their gear or something. That could be it. That door is locked. Okay. So I think we're gonna head back. Oh, this guy is here. I have no desire to throw down with him again. It probably would have been better for us to just take that shortcut home. Reboot in progress. System check what? initiated. Error. What the Bypassing. hell is this? Error. Bypassing. Oh, okay. Bringing primary weapon online. Okay. We got a boss. We got a boss. Secondary systems operation. Target is. Oh. We can target his legs only. Man, it's really strong. Are you kidding? <laughs> it just like... Each one of those swings was doing like... Half, more than half our health. Whoa. And it's our tech scrap there. Okay. Please remember, safety at work is our highest priority. At least I know roughly where it is. Be yours. Okay, I do not want to lose a bunch of health to these guys. If I can avoid it. Let's go! We can heal off the energy. Okay, now that was back through this way. Okay, well, the bosses, um... Cool, I was kind of starting to wonder about those, and now... Now we know. Oh, jeez. I'm actually just gonna... See if we can get there. Take out this guy. I'm 
gonna use that to heal instead. I believe. Yeah. Now is this like oh this is like a fog wall basically. Hello. Well that's our Oh shit. That's our scrap. Okay. Let's see what you got. Okay. Dark Souls has taught me anything. Get close and don't get stomped on. We can actually heal twice off of that. That's pretty good. Whoa. Are you kidding? Restricted area. Security violation in progress. This little slide underneath Security seems to be working. Gets us behind him. The risk is getting stomped on. For sure. He does not like us being close. We're building up like this. Whoa. Oh, hello. I thought we were building like armor or something for him. I don't know what he was doing there. I'm just gonna keep staying close. That's working. We're not dead. Restricted area. Security violation in progress. Hello. See how we're building up this yellow meter? Is that making him stronger? Or is that when we can, like, disable him like that? Whoa, what is this? Whoa, that was close. That was real close. Okay, so the meter's full. Subjugation authorized. Oh boy. Let's get back in close here. Oh god. That was real close. What? Oh my god. Getting wrecked here. There we go. Man, what do we do here? There we go. Oh, shit. Wow. All right. So, and look, his health is like still full. So, something. We've got to be doing something different there, and I'm not quite sure what that is, to be honest. Um, so the first time, we got him, like, stunned? Be but I can't- I'm not 100% sure as to how or why. Um, I'm just gonna see if we can run there, not take too much damage. Once he starts firing those rockets, do we avoid him or do we go in for the attack? Because it seemed like the first time we knocked him down was when he was... When we had that yellow bar filled.
This is interesting. Let's figure this out. There it is. Oh, God. Definitely being in close is the way to go. Can we block that? So we're filling up the yellow bar underneath. Now he's running. Now we're getting killed. Oh no, we hit him. So maybe that's what we need to do. Oh, we can target something else now. But I can't even reach it. I'm thinking I'm going to try and retarget the feet. Yeah, there we go. What the hell? Oh, there we go again. Okay, so I think we got to get him when he's in that second phase of whatever. That seems to be the only way I can deal damage to this guy. Oh, we can heal that off, no big deal. What? Oh, we got him down again. Okay, we're doing it. We're doing it. Oh. oh, we got him down again. I'll be honest, I'm not 100% sure what's triggering that yet. I don't love being trapped in this corner, though. Cool. Okay. Okay. I will say this uh, implant or injectable that we have 
is insanely good. Our sustain is, is so high because of this. Oh, that is rad. Okay. Look at this. Pax Imperator. 50 damage, which is higher than, way higher than what we have. Proficiency scaling high. Energy gain high. Attack speed low. But we're already using low. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, that is awesome. Careful. I think it is pretty slow. Oh, look at that move. That over the top. Yeah, it's it's very slow though. Like it is super freaking slow. But uh, whatever this implant is, this many voltaic injection, absolutely essential, I think. Wow, did we just three hit him? That's how much more damage this does? Doesn't even give us a chance to chop off his arms. Probably hitting him in the unarmored spots as well. Now, I think the tech scrap, so the longer or the more that we carry, uh, the more of it we get as bonus. I was originally thinking that the bonus was. Uh, due to chopping off arms. So look how we're getting the times 1.1. I was originally thinking that we got that because we we're chopping off limbs. But that, I don't think is the case. It just seems like the more we carry, the higher that, that bonus goes up. Which I guess kind of makes sense, too. It's like a risk-reward type thing. Oh. Okay, that was not as powerful as I thought a full charged strong attack was going to be. But, I will say we are handling enemies pretty quickly here. Welcome, Warren. Okay, first of all, we need, we're still short on um, headgear, body gear, and left leg gear. So let's create some of this stuff. Um, this is the headgear. Do we have other options for headgear? Goliath. Goliath headgear. Or the rhino headgear. Looks pretty good. Um, we can't construct this because we don't have those cortical processors. Damn. So how do I... I guess we just need to find more of those crafting components. We have alloys, but we don't have any of these, like, special things. Look at this thing. Upgrading this would be massive. But we're missing. We're missing things. Alloy Mark II. We can upgrade, like, our basic weapons. But everything else needs these force regulators. I'm pretty sure that when we... Anytime we check into the gear assembly... Uh, 
broken items and stuff that we found get broken down into those parts. I think that's how it works. Um, let's see. So we could just increase our core power. It's not a bad idea. But yeah, we cannot craft any of these as far as like... Oh, hold on, hold on. Hold on. We were on the Mark II versions. That's why. Once we increase the Mark, it increases it for everything and it doesn't reset. Damn it. Okay. Uh, the body gear we definitely want. We have the body gear. We can build the headgear as well. And that's it now. We'll bank the rest of our tech scrap. So headgear we're gonna throw on. Body gear we're gonna throw on. Oh, we can't. Because we need three more core power in a to enable us to use this. So let's actually, let's do this. Let's remove the right arm gear. Unequip that. We'll throw the body gear in in its place. And we'll go from there. Now, these things running around out here, these are links, right? I wonder if we equip all links gear, if we can get through that security protocol. Okay. So now, my question is, where exactly can we go from here? Nice. I'll take it. Like, I wonder if we wear a full thing of Lynx gear, if we can get through that thing at the bottom. Or maybe there was another section that we've, um, that had a door that we can now open. This weapon's, like, incredibly cool. Whoa. Should have probably healed off that one. Instead. Yeah, that's level 55, so I don't think that's the way. That's, that's like, that's the best. Maybe we do get a bonus for cutting off limbs as well as holding on to the uh, tech stuff. I'm just kind of thinking about that security scan, and that might be, like, our only way through, because I found, I think, pretty much everything else. There's nothing I can think of that's obvious about where we should go. Let's take another scan through here. This is 55. That is not happening. Okay, here's our light that we can put on now. Guess that's how it works. Back here will give us access to that power plant area again. Uh, let's see, area transition. 
I don't see that anywhere. Elevator, train station, rail tracks. Do we, can we actually get on that train maybe? Maybe that's what we need to do. I remember seeing that train. Hold on. We've not been back here. Oh boy. Whoa, what is this? Oh my god. Another boss? Okay, you know what? <laughs> okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go back to the med bay. We've got another boss, like, just like that. Boom, boom. I think. I don't- maybe that's just, like, one of- like, a really strong enemy or something. Might as well do this since it's gonna get rebuilt. Hello. What? What? Oh, they won't- okay. It won't open because this thing's around, maybe? Good to see nice. you. Nice. Oh yeah, really great to see me, obviously, when you're locking me outside. I feel really good about that. Feel really good about that. Um... Details. Customized to suit the evolving needs of our field technicians. You know what? I don't think this is the security stuff. This is just- this is the other class that we could have chosen. The Link stuff versus the Rhino stuff. The Rhino stuff obviously makes sense, so my security theory is completely out the window now. Um, which is fine. It, that's all good. And this- okay, so this is already Mark 1, so it has to go to Mark 2. This all makes so much more sense. Uh... Let's increase core power. Why not? We need it. Okay. So, uh, the last thing to maybe just review, let's do this at the med bay. Let's make sure we have the implants that we want. So I like the, the six healing things instantly. Um, restores health when doing finishing moves. It's not as good as this one. And like, maybe it's worth switching out. We can go more injectables. Or more, um... Oh, this is a V3. Four power consumption. Uh... But gives us much more health. That might be good, actually. Increases the amount of energy gained. This could be good as well. So what do we not need? I don't need the aggression amplifier. And the health gauge is probably very important, especially against the boss. Or bosses. But this needs four, so I don't think we can quite get there yet. So we're gonna have to go back to this one. Or, you know what? Let's do this instead. Let's get the energy gain faster, then we can heal more frequently, and we don't have to use our injections as much. Which we could argue then, maybe we don't need to have six, but... Uh, let's just, let's see how things go. Alright, I'm gonna take a break here when we come back. Uh, looks like we might be fighting another boss back in that area. We'll see. That's the only way that I know how to go forward for right now, so wish me luck. We'll see you guys soon. Take care. Bye.